Gee whiz, what the hey. So I escaped the old south and entered the time flux energy field and here I am in six gun Murgatroyd of 1889. Please tell me this is just a bad dream, one of those nightmares that the other flashy has all the time. Well, since I am here I might as well look for Dr. Getrick. Who knows, he might be here in this time period. I must say I don't care much for the architecture of Murgatroyd in 1889, but I guess I can deal with it. I just wonder how these poor primitive people are going to deal with a living, breathing paper doll. Boy this is going to be some fun. Oh boy, a peek yay, and yeehaw, this is going to be a blast. Well howdy miss, I reckon I ain't never seen you around these parts before. You, you must not be from around here. Oh, you're a pretty sweet thing. Uh, pardon me, I, I'd love to take you into the saloon here and buy you a drink. You you certainly don't look like a, a regular girl. You're pretty and all, but you're thin. You look like you're made out of paper. I don't know where you came from, but I'd be quite honored. Yes, if you come in here to the saloon and have a have a drink with me. It's here over here at the bar here is it's the bartender and all. I come in here lots. My name is Jake and this Miss Nelly here has a a brothel and all and I ain't saying you're that kind of girl at all. I, but, if, you know, if a girl hits hard times, it's always an option here. And I'd just be quite honored if you would sit here with me and, and have a drink. Well, Jake, you are much, much nicer than any human I have ever encountered before. I have never ingested alcohol before. So I have no idea how it will affect my system. You are right about me being made out of paper, but I do also possess human DNA. But anyway, Jake, my name is Flashy and I am here looking for Dr. Getrick. I must find him and talk to him.